Hello, my name is Andy Johnson. I'm at Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. And today I'd like to take a little bit of time and show you our brand new 2012 Bighorn 3855. This is a five slide fifth wheel. I'll show you the outside first and then we'll get to that inside. As you come up right here, one thing I just want to start, let's just start with the front here. We've got lots of nice storage right here. Nice thing about this storage here is you've got a central vacuum inside and right past that vacuum as you can see where there's heat to keep your contents warm when you're on the road. And it does have a rubber mat on the floor and it also does have tie downs right here for securing your items. Right here you've got all your hydraulics and you've got your battery right there. Right above you've got the outside speakers. One thing I like about these speakers is they're down low so you don't have to turn your uh, stereo way up. Okay, as we keep going, you've got the outside uh, awning, nice big awning, and it is power. You've got four steps into your coach right there. Gives you nice even steps. Aluminum rims right here. And then you've got the easy flex suspension right in between the tires you'll notice. Really helps make the ride easier on your contents. Another thing you'll notice is this, this fifth wheel has partial paint and so it gives it a real attractive outside. One thing I always like to point out is the gutters. There's gutters and downspouts from end to end and above the slides. Just a nice thing to keep that water coming off your camper, keep your camper clean. Right here we've got a, we open this up, we've got a button and the back jacks for power go right down. Beautiful rear cap on this big horn. Body paint really sets it off. As you can see it's got the outside ladder. This coach has got 50 amp service. More outside storage right here. Under the bed in the bedroom. One improvement that's nice is all the poles are right inside of here. So they're not out getting dirt all over them. Just a nice feature. As we keep going we've got the big slide. Here's your kitchen slide. Okay, now as we come to right here, one nice feature is your sewer hose goes right in this compartment, slides out. You've also got your outside shower right in there and you've got all your, uh, all your utilities can go right up through here and then you've got your cable satellite and then uh, black tank flush and you do have power and lighting in there. Here's two 30 pound propane tanks. ABS cover over the hitch to make it look nice. And as you look at the front of this aerodynamic cap, it's carved out for a short box truck and it gives you 88 degree turning. Now that you've seen the outside, let's go inside. Now we're inside. What we've got here is we've got the beautiful 50 inch Toshiba TV up front. It really sets this camper off. And then when you combine it with uh, the Greystone fireplace, and it's a nice wide fireplace. One of the, it's the widest one I've ever seen in a camper. And with the five slides, you get into this living room up in the front cap, and it really feels like a den. When we come over here, this camper is pre-wired for a WineGuard satellite. And one thing I also want to point out is you got your stereo system right here, and this is all set up to plug in your iPod, an SD card, or you can put in your HDMI cable. Okay, this bed right here goes out for company and it has an air mattress in it. Uh, one thing while we're up here I also want to point out is right up above here we've got our second air conditioner. We've got ducted air throughout and lots of little nice little features. Right over here, cup holders right there, there's storage under this couch, plenty of lighting, day and night shades, and what I'll do now is let's keep let's go down into the kitchen uh, solid surface countertops and if you take a little bit of time and look around this kitchen you'll see that you've got a huge fridge ice maker to the right here tons of deep storage nice hidden hinges 
solid surface countertops, really nice high rise faucets, okay? More hidden hinges and plenty of storage. Okay, a couple things I would really point out. Freezer is down nice and low. It's in the slide so I can look right in it. Convection microwave down nice and low so I can look right in it and see how I'm cooking. Um, then we've got the dinette right here. One nice feature is it's got the big window and the chairs do pop up for storage. Okay. And then you've got the nice china hutch right in the corner here. One thing that's really caught my eyes is, is a, while I'm standing here, is a couple things. I really like this lighting above the table. It's got a rich look to it. And then if you keep going up, you've got the ceiling fan right above with the light on it. Really nice. And one thing that I kind of missed as I went by here, it's really nice to have a hanger already in for your coats. And then you've also got central vacuum right here. Hook that up and um, it's, it's nice central location. I'm not going to be able to pull this out, but there's a drawer right here that pulls out for storage. And now we'll go look at that big bathroom. Okay, first thing as we come in the bathroom is to your left is big storage. Stackable washer dryer if you want it or just a really big closet. Really nice to have. Okay, now we've got uh, the big shower. Plenty of room, plenty of height. And then you've got a uh, big medicine cabinet. Solid surface countertops on the sink. Nice brushed oil rubbed bronze faucets. Uh, plenty of nice porcelain stool. And what I was going to say is there's plenty of knee room in front of it. Nice storage right above the commode right there. Okay, now let's go into the nicest bedroom that you can get in a fifth wheel. Since it's a five slide, we've got two slides in here, and we got since we're not in the cap, we've got plenty of ceiling height up above. So what you've got here is you've got a big king bed, and this is a pillow top. There's two more chairs there for the dinette that we looked at earlier, and a lot of storage under there. Plenty of storage up above the bed. Both windows open on each side of the bed for um, for airflow, and then you've got a beautiful big window. If you back this into a, a site with a view behind you, you're in heaven. Now let's go on to the next nice big drawers. I mean, when do you ever see a drawer like that? And then you can put whatever size TV you want right here. Hanging storage on each side for his and for hers. And then down here, tons of drawers. Look at this. This whole thing, let's just see pulls out. Nice thing about that, then you don't have to go back underneath to get to it. That is our five slide big horn here at Bullion RV. If you have any questions on this fifth wheel or any of our other inventory, please call me, Andy Johnson, at 218-391-2000.